come to TDS online math. All right, let's provide solution, okay, to this problem. We are, we are to solve for M and N, okay? So let's get started. All right, so we have root M, then root N, okay, throughout. So we should let, let X be square root of M then y b square root of n so this side will be x plus y cos 9 let's call this one equation one then x y equals 9 equation 2 now let's make equation one okay let's make one of the variables here the subject then I put it in equation two so from here you can see x is the same as nine minus y okay so how we come to equation two this is x so i'll put nine minus y there okay where this one is to that so it will multiply cos nine so i'll have nine y minus y squared equals to nine so which will be so y squared minus 9y plus 9 equal to 0. So this one becomes quadratic. Okay. So if I compare this one with the general quadratic formula, ax squared plus bx plus c equal to 0. My a, okay, is 1. My b is minus 9 then c is 9 okay so using the formula so we have minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4 ac on 2a all right so let's do substitution here so we have minus b b so we have minus minus nine plus or minus b squared so we have minus nine squared minus four times a is one and c is nine all over two times one okay so this side will be y cos 9 plus or minus okay so we have 81 minus 946 so we have 81 minus 36 over 2 let's confirm yeah okay so we have y equals to nine plus or minus. So this side will be 45 on two, which is the same as nine plus or minus. So 45 is the same as square root of nine times square root of five, nine, five, 45 on 2 will be the same as 9 plus or minus so this side will be 3 3 root 5 on 2 so that is why now let's recall
now remember x is the same as 9 minus y okay so x 9 minus y but y is what this so let's do substitution x equals 9 minus so let me put this one there 9 plus or minus 35 on 2 okay all right so we can write this one as over one okay so we have two here that's the LCM one into two is two times nine eighteen minus so two into two one one times that so we have nine plus or minus three five okay so let's go ahead and simplify this side so my x will be so we have 18 so minus 9 so this side will be so minus plus okay 3 5 on 2 so 18 minus 9 is 9. So we have x equals to 9 minus or plus. Okay. So 3 root 5 on 2. 3 root 5 on 2. Okay. Now let's observe the values of x and y were now we have x and y now let's look for the values of y so this is y okay and we have that of x over there so my x will be 9 minus or plus 3 root 5 on 2 and my x is 9 plus or minus 3 root 5 on 2 but remember square root of m let's recall we said square root of m is bx then that of n by x y so now that we know the values of x and y let's find that of m okay so it means x will have values so case case one so when x is when x is nine minus three root five on two so let's equate which size we have square root of m equals to nine minus three root five on two so our square root size square both sides so we have m as this so this side will be 9 squared 81 okay minus 2 times 9 18 18 times 3 so we have 2 times 9 times 3 5 okay plus this one squared that will be 45 on 2 squared 4 okay 
so two times two times nine eighteen times three so we have eighteen times three four two so we have sixty four Minus sixty four root five plus forty five on two. Sorry, on four. Okay, so let's add this eighteen forty five ten. So we have x sixty three minus sixty four root five on four. Okay, that is when x equals minus. Okay, so let's work for when x equals nine plus 3 root 5, when x is 9 plus 3 root 5 on 2. So we equate this one to 2. Um, square root of m. 9 plus 3 root 5 on 2. So when you square both sides, so this one will cancel your I will give you this. So when you square, when you go through the same process, I think the answer will come. Now let's check for that of y. Now y is also nine plus or minus three root five on two. So I think this one is symmetrical. When x is plus, y is minus, and when um, y is minus, x is plus. So I think this one is very simple. So that is it solution all right okay